much. The time has come. Not yet. Oh, it's so close. It's Monday evening now, and this is really the final time we can have anything like enjoyment, because Tuesday and Wednesday will be non-stop packing and making sure this... the Fiat is ready with the trailer that we haven't touched, literally haven't touched in eight months. And Monica and I stupidly forgot there was a slightly weird creaking sound for the last 50 miles from the trailer. We remember that this morning, which is too late. So we're going to attach that to the car tomorrow. Hope it's okay. Bike on the back of that tomorrow, Tuesday and Wednesday, non-stop packing. So we're off to the beach, bottle of wine. Mm -hmm. Well, Monica may have more than me because I'll be driving, but bottle of wine, enjoy the sunset. And this is the final bit of enjoyment of Tenerife. Can't believe it's almost here, three days and we leave. In fact, when this video goes live, which will be 5 p.m. on Thursday, we will be somewhere along the west coast of Africa, sailing north. You may notice, Wheeler Dealers Tenerife. I thought the, the Fiat deserved it, so I book, booked it in for an oil change and a general check over, just to make sure there's nothing dangerous for a one and a half thousand mile trip back. So they checked over the car, made sure nothing's dangerous, nice new oil change, the cost, 35 euros. 35 euros. Incredible. Isn't it? Yeah. It's incredible value, it really is. So everything's done, checked, car fine, looks safe, and looks like it will make it to the one and a half thousand miles. Current mileage on the Fiat, 188,783. So by the time we get back to the UK, it will be well over 190,000 miles. Plus, it will be towing, bike and trailer included, about 300 kilos on the back, and the car will be so full, I'm honestly 70% at best sure that we'll actually be able to fit everything in the car. So the next two days will be very hit and miss, a little bit stressful, and there'll probably be a few trips to Chinatown to buy some <laughs> straps to strap a bit of stuff onto the trailer. It's gonna be interesting. There's a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart moves slow Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am holy? Back where I belong. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. Wait, hold on. Put me together. Take me back where I belong. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. Take you back to my youth And show you what I wish I'd knew My will is strong with a place to lean In the moment I... I mean, just look at where we are now. It's... It's the quality of life. Let me stand up for a second. Grab my wine. Because... We've got... The sunset setting over Lagomara there touristy bits just flip over this side monica the touristy bit ends about two miles that way the strip that the brits are famous for ends or starts right over here 
and the golden miles there as well but you've just got everything and it's the quality of life because we're here now 8 30 in the evening enjoying a wine by the sea and you just want to be outside all of the time imagine the most amazing summer's day in the UK where everyone's outside everyone wants to either be on their bikes or they want to be at the beach or they want to be cycling everyone's happy everyone's outside and everyone could not be in a better mood you get that amazing peak summer vibe and the thing with Tenerife is it's that every single day of the year it never ever gets old every day that we've woken up here I sound so corny but could not be happier and more excited to start the day oh it's a magical place I cannot describe how much I love it here I almost forgot to mention just before the sun sets three places that I've I've been to I've used the bikes from if you're a biker the three rental companies that I would recommend if you're in the north of Tenerife Mass K Moto lovely couple Tenerife locals who run that company good selection of bikes right on the north coast of the island and if you're here in the touristy section the southern section of the island you've got two you've got Easy Rider Tenerife with a huge selection of modern classic bikes and Tenerife on Triumph with three or four different very high level Triumphs T120s and Triumph Bobbers so they are the three companies I'd recommend now plans after leaving Tenerife should we walk and talk yes that's true plans after leaving Tenerife mm -hmm. Once we get back, I'm almost immediately, well, Monica and I are going to Essex for a little road trip. After an Essex road trip, we've got Bike Shed. Maybe that comes before, but basically we've got the Bike Shed show, Essex road trip. I'm then riding the Bonneville to Barcelona for a road trip. And then I'm riding all the way back on a big detour, which will be about two and a half thousand miles. After Barcelona, we're spending a month in Ipswich. After Ipswich, Monica is going to Lithuania she's going home <laughs> six years it's been since Monica was in Lithuania yeah. so we're going back there Monica will make an emotional reunion <laughs> with I'm sure some family members maybe we'll go to Vilnius after Vilnius back to the UK and then off to Croatia for probably a big one month road trip yeah Fiat 500 trailer attached and Bonneville on the back and then Monica, where are we off to after Croatia? Southeast Asia. Southeast Asia. Southeast Asia. We'll probably do a big, maybe two month trip to Southeast Asia, maybe Vietnam, Indonesia, Thailand, and stuff like that. And then after that, very possibly back here. Monica did say, if you had a balancing scale, how excited you are for future opportunities or future travel, and how sad are you to leave Tenerife? Mm -hmm. Weigh it up, it's very close to 50 50, but probably just the excitement yeah. of, of the new adventures but honestly the amount of amazing people we've met in Tenerife I didn't think I'd be this sad to leave I am genuinely yeah we made some amazing friends we did didn't we yeah, we yeah. Did. I'm gonna miss it so much couldn't do our last video in Tenerife without coming to the place we come probably more than any other this is almost like our Friday evening ritual 100 pizza social club mm -hmm. right in the touristy heart of Los Cristianos and it's the best pizza I have ever had in my life this is number 24 Fresca if you're coming here and the pizza chef is always the same guy he is he's a magician yes. he's, an, he's an artist his pizzas are off the scale amazing so we'll end it there just before we start tucking into the pizza thank you so much for everyone 
who's come along with us in this, I can't even believe it, eight month Tenerife adventure. We hugely appreciate everyone who's ever commented and watched the videos and everyone who's come along for it. Next video will be, well, it will be, we don't know how many days yet, but it will be the first day or two of our trip all the way back to the UK. So thank you so much, everyone, and we'll see you in the next one.